Working on the weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they pass. What's up, my bells? It's your girl Shelby, and I'm back with another video for y'all today. So I'm be doing a reaction video. It says, Wedding fight erupts when Florida man attacks bride. What? I'm gonna be Florida man. Like, is he at the wedding? Did he crash the wedding? Like, how exactly did he get into this wedding to come and messing with these people? I don't get it. Hold on. But like, how exactly did he get into this wedding to come messing with these people? Like, he had to, he gotta be like a guest at the wedding. Because like, you can't even mess up them people wedding? Like, are you serious? Like, I, I'm ready to see what's about to happen. And I know y'all ready to see what's about to happen. So, before we do that though. And as y'all like this video, comment down below, share the channel, tell a friend, tell a friend, to 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 subscribe like the Shelby on the road to 100k, y'all help me get there. And let's get this video out the way, because this is crazy. Get on the ground. 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 It's just before 10 p.m. in Pinellas County, Getting crazy already where one couple's nuptials had just turned into a nightmare. Police were called to this event. He don't set out like he wasn't doing that when you like you weren't just banging on the banging or kicking on that dough. No, he I'm sorry, I ain't doing that. Like, boy, stop playing. After the man seen here allegedly attacked multiple wedding goers, mm -hmm. including the bride and groom. Hey, hey, go back over there. What? Come on. So he did this at his sister's wedding? What? Police identify the suspect as 45 year old Ronte Stokes, the brother of the bride and the son of the woman he just had that heated exchange with. While officers try to calm down Ronte, Let's check in with the bridal party who is, let's just say, not happy about the situation. Right? I'm trying to help you. No, you don't care about that. Don't like that. 
Where is the lieutenant? Fine. Stop. Where is the lieutenant? Stop. He's not here. Oh, give me the phone. Let me die. No, no, no. Do not call 911. Don't tell me what to do. I'm, I'm telling you right now. Do not call 911. Give me the phone. Did you not have to call her like that? You're the last in this room to a lieutenant. You can't ever do that. I am trying to tell you to ask your friends to come back here so they don't go to jail. Because that lady has put hands on. Stop. You don't curse at me. That lady. I didn't curse you. That lady. I didn't curse you. You got to kill him. Witnesses tell police Ronte pushed down the bride, fought the groom, and attacked at least three other people before hurling a chair at the venue doors, causing at least $800 in damages. And it's not hard to see that our suspect's temper might run in the family. Y'all see all my mom all up in two and I ain't even talking like it's getting good like like I don't understand there's a lot of stuff going on I can't even keep track of everything that's like going on it's like everybody yelling and screaming and it's just like I want to know what happened like what, what what led up to this fight so like let's continue I'm I'm my children. We need to that's the one that's taking the shit right now okay we need to de-escalate this Crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. Okay, relax. It's crazy. Can you tell me what happened? Can you calm down and tell me what happened? I don't know what happened. All I know is my son uh -huh. and my daughter's husband got into an argument. Okay. So we locked the door so he couldn't come in. Okay. I opened the door and he came in. Okay. They started fighting. Okay. After they started fighting, we broke them up. Hey, you got let me see my daughter. No, no, no. I got to see my daughter. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, I got to see my daughter. I got to see. Let them see. Let me come down. Please, let me come down. Please, knock my mama down. He came in. He came in. I'm not here. 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 I'm that's all they doing is screaming in each other's faces. I don't understand. Like, they need to all just calm down, take a chill pill, relax, and, and try to get their words together. Because right now, it's just like causing all this extra commotion that doesn't have to be there. As the mother of the bride storms off, let's check in with our suspect on his way to a patrol car. We'll talk to you in a second, all right? Listen, we're going to calm them down first. And then we're going to go. They both are here, my man. I can't, I can't right now. Just give us a second to work through some stuff, okay? I'm going to be quiet. I'm going to be quiet. This is my sister. I'm going to tell you whatever. This is my sister. Okay, man, for a second. Man, a boyfriend this. Okay. And we, you know, we all did and whatever. I got gotcha. you. Y'all been drinking, I'm guessing? Hell, it's real. I ain't gonna lie to you. Alright, bro. How about this? Just take a seat real quick for me. Hey, put your feet up. Okay. Like, you can slide all the way back, okay? I got you. Back with the amped up bridal party, one officer is doing his best to calm the situation. Okay, that's what I'm telling you. Because that lady hit me twice, and she hit him twice, right? So we need to settle this down before anyone goes to jail other than that man. Okay? Okay. Is there anyone else other than that man is creating an issue here? Okay, so that situation is contained for right now, correct? Yes. Okay, who all was hit, and how can we help? The kid was being choked. Okay. Okay, they have paramedics coming. Is he the only one that needs to see a paramedic? Yes, right. Yeah, that's why he's in the car. I have to sort out who needs help. And that guy is the only person that needs to 
be handled right now, right? He was acknowledging okay. I, I, I understand right? he was probably way more than that. Okay? So Who is that person to you, ma'am? The brother. He is your brother. Okay. So he is domestic related. And that nice lady right there is your mom. Come here. Stop getting my damn call. Please calm down, ma'am. I don't think that. 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 I because I'm trying to I am talking and he's no. touching me. He don't gotta touch me. I'm asking me. you to stop because I'm trying to talk to I'm talking to my mom though. Right. And you guys called 911 and I'm here. So please step away for two minutes. Okay? You know what? Y'all can't when y'all want to call anyway. No. I got it. No. I got it. No. No. Wondering who's missing from this equation? As that officer keeps working with those witnesses, another goes looking for the groom. Hey, man, we got the fire department coming here. We're going to check you out, make sure you're good. I know you're bleeding. If it's something big, don't throw bang on you, and that'll be it, all right? I don't know what happened out here, man, uh, but we just want to make sure you're, you're okay, all right? Do you want to talk to me? Because we got a lot of angry people outside. They, they can stay, they won't, they won't. No, I understand, I understand. Well, do you want to talk to me real quick? I want to talk to you in the men's room. What's up, man? What happened? Who is that? Ron Tisto, that's the good brother. That's who's brother? Going through something in there, and the wild ice and to go back outside with all that, and he... That's your, that's your soon-to-be wife's brother? Yes. Okay. And he pushed her down. Push her down? Okay. I said, you're dead wrong, you're dead wrong, and then he came at me. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, do you mind if I take pictures of injuries on your face? Mm -hmm. Okay. Meanwhile, one officer reads Ronte his Miranda rights and asks him a few questions. Let's see what he has to say. Walk me through what All happened to I know, you. Okay, I can tell you this. Uh, I did. My sister was coming at me. I pushed her fat down. Okay. No. Uh, whatever else going on, I do not know what's going on. But my sister, yeah, she was rushing at me and I pushed her down. You know what I'm right. All right. Um, and then what about her uh, boyfriend, Winnie? Well, now they're they're the groom, right? They're married now. That's yeah, they're boy, married. Yeah, yeah, yeah. the fat boy. Okay, so what <laughs> is what happened there? Okay, okay, my sister. I was in there coming out getting something to eat, and I tried to say something to her. So what what happened? What, how did this start, though? Okay, this not, okay. I'm finna take you way back. No, I, I need to know what happened. No, I'm finna take no. Man, I'm taking way back. Okay. They play games on the uh, the tuxedo. You know, warehouse. Mm -hmm. So I go out there, I catch an Uber. I don't have no car. Mm -hmm. They tell me I went on the own, the, the, the grooms, whatever the fuck it was. Okay, so I called them. Oh, well, we go, we called them, oh, put you on the tuxedo, this is not. It costs 200 and something dollars for a tuxedo. I went for the rent no $200, 200, I mean, $200 tuxedo. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the night. Okay, I give her a hug and all that. Now, what boils down, I give her a hug and she push me off. So I'm like, damn, what's going on? I'm your little brother. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, I got you. So I try to hug, you know, I'm the I'm the goof one in the, in the family. I got you. So you just trying to give her a hug? Yeah, I love to kick games, talk bullshit. That's me. Okay. So I think what I did, she think I was bullshit or whatever. She took it serious. Uh -huh. The officer continues talking to the suspect while the mother of the bride is not exactly making the situation any better. <laughs> Inside. Come on! Come on! Come on! 
I was in the war on Texas. I was trying to rock, stop on Texas. Don't have to do it. I'm trying to stop you. What do you do for you? You got me three dollars for nothing. I was trying to get your brother to stop. Let me talk to my daughter, please. What the permit? Come for a second, please. Please. Ain't no wrong with her. Let me talk to my child. I have permit. It's treat her. Okay, treat her. As if the bride hasn't had enough, the groom adds the icing on the wedding cake as he makes his exit. Get him like me, or Come on, man, get the f up here. Blowing right past his newlywed wife. Officers are eventually able to calm everyone down and get them on their way. But back with Ronte, who has been taken to a nearby parking lot away from the scene, things have de-escalated a little too much. <laughs> Ronte, you gotta get up there. Step up. Can you step up? Ronte. Ronte, Ronte Stokes. Where's Ronte? Step up here, bud. Hey, you gotta step up there, my man. There you go. Uh, you got your good dog. You do it? There, there you, you go. go. Ronte Stokes was taken to a nearby hospital for medical care and then to jail, where he was booked for criminal mischief and five counts of felony battery, marking one wedding present this family will always remember. Ronte's case remains open. That is crazy. Like, I've never heard of nothing like that before. That's... That, I know they gotta, like, hurt your brother and push you down at your wedding, like... You didn't got married. Your husband and left. Like that's uh, they. Yeah, they definitely. She's definitely not gonna ever forget this. Like that's and that's horrible for her. I'm so sad for her. Like oh my gosh, and your mama yelling. Everybody's just yelling. Like this is supposed to be a joyful night for you, and like all of this is happening. Like that is that's crazy. And really like. <laughs> And really, like, from the looks of it, I feel like after every little function, they get a little drink in them. And they start acting crazy because this can't be, like, the first time. Oh, we just had this little bitty fight. No. Because brother already said, now I'm a fool. I'm a fool with me. And whatever he said, I don't know. So, and I know that, the, the yeah, they all was just too loud and just, like, too. They was just doing too much for them to just be this one time that they got into this little one altercation. And especially at a wedding. So, I know probably 4th of July. Um, you know, what else? Memorial Day, Labor Day, anywhere you drink, they they acting crazy. Or I can just see it. Like <laughs> these family functions they that they have do I bet you they do not end well. I, I just feel it in my soul. I feel it. <laughs> but still none of this should have happened at this lady's wedding, at this lady and man's wedding at all. That was just like totally uncalled for. I still I don't know how it started though just because she I don't see how I don't know I don't know his story didn't really like go together so I'm gonna start from the beginning I'm gonna start from the way back way back I'm gonna start way back like you know you didn't really start way back you started two months ago at the <laughs> for the funeral for the tuxes tux, tuxedos or whatever tuxes 
But yeah, um, I guess the husband say he about to dip off. He ain't, he ain't even like. I wonder, was that like blood in his beard or what? It was like red and white. It was like white and red or something. Hopefully not. That would've been crazy. Yeah, he, he said he gotta go and go. He didn't even look a whole way. He said deuces. Like, I don't know who that, oh, she said her brother, his brother. But yeah, comment down below what y'all think. Do y'all feel like he gonna get a divorce? How do y'all think that's gonna go? I don't even know. I really wanna like stay in tune with this, but I don't know. I'ma look up his name and then I'ma see what else happened just because i'm nosy you know <laughs> but comment down below what y'all think like i just said don't forget to like this video comment down below share the channel tell a friend tell a friend tell a friend tell a friend subscribe like and share me and i'll see y'all in the next video peace working on the weekend like usual way off in the deep end like usual niggas sweat it